morning. It was raining all night long until 7 in the morning. Now it's 7.30, I stood up. That's always the time I stood up. I, I'm, I am standing up. Um, yeah, now I will cook coffee and then I can start the day. Tell me, where are we here? We are here at the farm which is called Bayern Kamele in the Mangfall Valley. Um, we have got here 17 camels, we have got sheep, donkeys, llamas and some other animals and we offer uh, all of it for children, birthday or we do um, some hiking with the camels and guided tours through the forest with them. How does everything started? Well, my husband, he grew up with two camels and uh, when he was 14 or 15 years old he got more interested uh, of those animals and after a while he thought well there will be some crazy people love to ride on camels and so um, he started to buy some more camels and now um, we, we have them we breed them and uh, we make since 17 years our living with that and uh, we are very successful with it so you told me before that those camels are a special kind of camels and uh, these are not dromedars um, and yes those are uh, camels and they are coming from asia they are in home in, in for example in mongolia and in the desert gobi there they uh, experience minus 40 degrees in winter time so they are used to the german climate that's nothing for them the moment uh, they are a little bit naked because they lost their winter fur and um, now the summer fur is coming and until winter they, uh, they will be really uh, big and having a lot of fur again. They love to eat each and everything here and if I would let them they would eat down everything which is growing here uh, with the exception of two uh, plants. Yesterday the storm uh, killed two trees and so today they, uh, they have got some trees to eat because they really uh, love the leaves of it and eating those little benches. Due COVID, we are not a public 
camel farm anymore. So if you want to visit us, you have to call us, you have to make a date. Uh, uh, we, um, uh, we are limited our offers and uh, we became a little bit smaller. Do you know that feeling if you are entering a village or a tiny little city and like this here otter thing and your entire body and your soul and every cell of yourself is screaming and asking for ice cream. Well, but I'm not sure if they have got something like that here. It is really small, but I will talk to the universe. Well, it was not a gelateria, not an ice cream bar, but at least it's an ice cream. Somewhere here, I would love to spend the night because I already hiked 23 kilometers. I have got 20 kilometers left to Wolfratshausen, so that would be enough for today. And, uh, 